Okay, Pete. This lab has feeders to lure in birds and analyze their droppings. Yeah, that's right. I got an MBA to test bird poop. <laughs> Seriously, though, you probably know that birds carry diseases that affect people, and we need to make sure they're healthy. You know, I really wish I was there to hear your finest toilet humor on this one. Uh-oh. The pigeons are infected with a serious strain of avian flu, and it's already mutated to a form that can spread to humans. Okay, Harry's lab had everything I needed to make a vaccine. Gotta spread it fast, or the pigeons will be like rats with the bubonic plague. My best bet's dispersing it at three major migration points. Luckily, the station told me where they are. First migration point's in a park. Birds there should spread the vaccine to their buddies. Pigeons put up with me swinging through their territory, so I owe them a favor. I bet the Avengers never have bird poop missions. Here we go. The vaccine's airborne, so I'll just spray it into the trees. Wave to my grandma. Okay, one down, two to go. Well, the spray won't bother people or other animals, but it'll cure the pigeons. Or trigger the zombie pigeon apocalypse. And one more left. I wonder what Jameson will make of this. Spider-Man spreads chemtrails, seems like a good bet. I like helping animals. They don't call me a menace or shoot at me or anything. I wonder if it'd be stretching things if I added veterinarian to my resume. Okay, that should work fast. I'd better scan some pigeons to make sure. I did it. No zombie pigeons. Huh. Nikola Tesla fed pigeons here. So did Harry's mom. I remember her bringing this. I wish I could tell Harry, but he's not answering calls, texts, anything. Daily Bugle. Always a great paper. Even more now that Jameson's retired. Not getting much coverage. I should look for more towers to activate.
rockets. Demons need a vacation or something. These are way too high strung. Got it, boss. Tripling security. Demons won't touch a thing. Listen up! Demons are making moves on all our caches. Lost two tonight already. Boss may be in lockup, but that don't mean his hardware's up for grabs. Com check. Eagle 2, you up? Eagle 2 reporting in. Eyes on. What caches are the demons after? I need to take out Fisk's men and figure out what they're guarding. Whatever it is, I don't want it in Fisk's or the demons' hands. Snipers everywhere. I need to deal with them first. Let me focus. Phew. Finally out of sight. Sniper has a guard watching him. May need to divide and conquer. I literally didn't see that coming.
inside of him. Gotta be the spider. Watch your back. You know we can't have vigilantes trespassing or doing illegal searches. Yeah, I know. Which is why I brought a warrant. So what do you say we do some perfectly legal searching? I like the sound of that. What's your name? Officer Davis. Call me Jeff. And you are? Uh... uh... <laughs> Just messing with you. My son's a big fan. So, that warrant cover breaking down doors? Not without a lot of extra paperwork. Okay. I'll find another way in. Any place this rundown should have a hole in the wall or a broken window. Check around back. I'd go myself, but you know, not Spider-Man. I feel like I'm in a horror movie. Hello? Any fishermen with a grudge and a hook for a hand? Okay, where's that locked door? Jeff, you there? I'm doing my best to refrain from knock-knock jokes. Appreciate it. You see a junction box powering the door? Yeah, got it. If we can overload it, that should force the door open. I've been working on electric webbing. This is the perfect field test. Sit tight. Electric web for the win. A gadget man, huh? You remind me of my son. Started taking apart the TV when he was five. <laughs> now he's unlocking his friend's phones. Sounds like he could teach me a few things. Okay. Nothing illegal in plain sight? Kinda anticlimactic, huh? At first glance. 
Let's look closer. Looking for something specific? This yard's been here a long time. Bootleggers used to use it back in the day. Gotcha. Those guys love their hidden rooms. Check it out. Sound hollow to you? I've got a hidden panel, like the one on the door. The conduits lead out the back. Look for another junction box. Let's see if my mask lenses can pick up the conduits. Did that work? Nah. Must not be the right box. Keep looking. Thanks. No way I could have unlocked this myself. Hey, I doubt I would have found it without you. Hmm. I got a big fat nothing. Well, there's one secret room that could be more. Notice anything about the floor? Uh -huh. They can hide the doors, but not the scrapes they leave. Keep an eye out for more of those. Now that I know I'm after scrapes, I should take another look around. Found a scrape. Oh. I guess normal doors don't count, huh? Good guess. Where else could there be scrapes? Pay dirt! Scrape, no door. None I can see, anyway. Great. Be right there. Maybe not. Elevator's busted. Sit tight. I'll pull you up. <laughs> Second floor. Rusted machine parts. Big honking rats. <laughs> Careful. The bridge is out. I got this one. <laughs> nice. Stuck the landing and everything. We're not all donut eaters. <laughs> Fair enough. Another secret door. I'll rig the lock. Let me know if you find the junction box. Yep, on it. <laughs> Found one. Nailed it. Hell yeah, you did. Hey, check this out. Nothing. I'm starting to feel like this is Fisk's way of messing with me. But look at the walls. They kept guns here. They wouldn't have moved them to the front door. Gotta be a passageway we're missing. Check out the wall. This might control access to another area. Fisk's men were talking about a vault. Maybe we're close. Bet on it. Looks like a dual circuit. See if you can find a second junction box. If I were a junction box, where would I be? Follow the conduits. They should lead you in the right direction. <laughs> Found it. Clear. You were right, Jeff. Trap door. Outstanding. Think you can help me out? This thing's heavy. One, two, three. Well, that isn't spooky at all. Probably an old bootlegger's tunnel. And it looks like no one's cleaned it since Al Capone. Big chunk of concrete in the way. I can't get through. Let me see how it looks from the top. Got room to maneuver here. Hang on. What was that? Subway, maybe. Let's hustle. Place is unstable. 
Okay, that definitely wasn't a subway. No. It sounded like explosives. And that sounds like demons. The vault! Hurry! Demons are already gone. How'd they beat us here? Must be a back door. See if you can find it. This place is one hell of an offering. Or was. There. They blew the locks to get in. Shh. Demons. Stay here. Hell no. It'll take both of us to stop them. And some of these. They're moving. Get him! Trucks full of gunmen in one day. It's time to hang up the web. Oh. 
we've now identified the officer as Jefferson Davis. We're being told he has minor injuries and is expected to make a full recovery. Excuse me, miss. Are you supposed to be here? More than you. After that auction house thing, the bugle put me on the city beat, which means I get to focus full time on real stories like this and the demons. You know the closer you get to them, the more you become a target, right? The closer I get, the better chance we have to stop them. We? Officer Davis, Mary Jane Watson, Daily Bugle. No comment. I don't blame you. But these guys are gonna tell their story with or without you, and they thrive on controversy. So what's your end? I don't have one. I just listen. Okay. Up in. She's good. Man, I'm beat. Time to head home and get some sleep. Come on. Empire Sanitation, this is Eddie. Yeah, hi. Uh, I'm trying to track down some items that were accidentally picked up from a dumpster outside my apartment. Dumpster number? Uh, uh, hang on. Uh, 64476. That's round 33. Truck's already left at shift. If your stuff's not there, you're out of luck. Wait, wait, please. This is important. Can you at least tell me where the truck is? <sighs> Let me check. All right. Looks like it should be at the municipal garage at Bowery and Grand. Got it. Thanks, Eddie. Municipal garage, Bowery and Grand. Not a problem. I don't care if I lose everything else. I have to find my Spidey drive. Can't be that hard. Finding a tiny flash drive in a 30-ton garbage truck. I have years of research on that drive. Everything I've worked on since high school. it's locked. Can't have people stealing garbage. Maybe there's another way in. It's not really breaking and entering if I don't break anything, right? Okay, no need to panic. Maybe they haven't dumped the trash yet. Nada. Ugh. Okay, time to panic. Empire Sanitation, this is Eddie. Sorry, is there any chance the truck wasn't at the garage? Sure, I guess. Just means it'd be somewhere in West Chinatown. Great. I'm headed there now. Hey, it's a long shot. But sometimes the guys stop for pizza before they drop off. Really? I'll check out the pizza shops. Any idea which one? One of the mom and pop joints, I think. Jerry's? No, that's uptown. I mean, original Jerry's. Oh, right. No, started with an L, I think. Larry's? That's on the east. Wait, I think I see the trucks. Thanks, Eddie. Should be some trucks close by. Nope, stuff's not here. 
There has to be another truck around here. No sign of my stuff. <laughs> what an interesting smell. Eddie, my only hope. Not there either, huh? You sure they were around here? Well, the guys might have switched routes due to the upcoming Osborne rally. If your pickup was on Route 35, they'd be dropping off at the incinerator right now. Incinerator? Over by Manhattan Bridge. Better hustle. Confucius Plaza. I could use some of his wisdom right about now. There's the incinerator. Hope I'm not too late. Uh-oh. Looks like trouble. Thanks, Spider-Man. You okay? Yeah, thanks. This gang's been terrorizing the whole neighborhood the last couple of days. There's probably more of them on the way. I'll keep an eye out. Hey, mind if I look around for some, uh, some personal items? Sure, have at it. I gotta go file an incident report. There's something there. Gotta move these bags out of the way. I think that's it. Ah! Please be here, please be here. Yes! Hope it still works. Phew, looks like everything's here. Hey, look, an old gadget prototype. Looks kind of awesome. Why didn't I ever finish it? Uh, I think I can make this work. Look, it's that guy, Spider Man. Uh oh. Ice! Okay, well, this night isn't quite going as planned. Where am I gonna sleep? Guess I could try MJ's. All right, how am I gonna talk my way onto MJ's couch? Let's see. Uh, hi, MJ, it's Peter. Any chance I could stay over it? Oh, that's too far. MJ! I was just in the neighborhood and... Oh, that's lame. Hey, MJ. Now that we're talking again, I thought maybe... Okay, that just sounds pathetic. Why am I making this such a big deal? We're just friends, right? Friends crash on each other's couches all the time. It's not weird or anything. It's just a couch. MJ's couch. Oh, what am I thinking? Hmm, just got a web alert. Huh, looks like MJ's story just got published. I think I'll find somewhere else to stay. She's probably busy with work. I wish Harry was in town. I could crash with him. Hmm, someone left me a voicemail. Numbers blocked, though. Hey there, Spider. Long time no see. Miss me? Come to this address. Catch me if you can. Uh-oh. I think I know that voice.
shots fired, officers down. Hello, Spider. Been thinking about you a lot lately. We were good together, weren't we? Maybe it's time to reignite the flame. Black Cat. Don't tell me she's scoping out places to rob. She promised she would give up that life. What was she looking at? Anything look out of place? There. One of her cats. She packs those with range extenders, then harvests nearby RFID signals. I'll let Yuri know to pick it up. Felicia's too smart to be putting herself at risk like this. She must be desperate for some reason. Better keep an eye out. Hey, Yuri. You still have Black Cat's suit and equipment in the evidence lockup, right? I think so. Why? Is she back at it? Maybe. Just double check and let me know if her gear is still there. Will do. Hey, May. You're calling late. What's up? I thought we were going to meet up for dinner tonight. Oh, right. I'm sorry, I forgot. It's been a hard day. We lost funding at the lab. Oh, Peter, I'm sorry. I also kind of got evicted from my apartment. What? Do you have a place to stay tonight? Actually, no. Not really. I hate to ask, but any chance you have room at the shelter? Well, of course. Feel free to use the couch in my office. Thanks, May. I believe I haven't slept since the Fisk takedown. Gotta start taking better care of myself. You guys play this late? I was a long haul trucker before I lost my lease. Nights when it's quiet, easy to think. Not easy enough where you're playing. My late husband snored. I was always up. Well, it's nice you got company. Better than nothing. Barely. Have a good night, you two. So late. Oh, I uh, had a little mix-up at my apartment. On the street, huh? I know the look. You're in the right place. Nothing to be ashamed of. I know, I just... I hate to take resources from people who need them. Guess what, pal? Right now, you need them. You got a point. Thanks, Gloria. Hope May's couch is comfortable. I, I can't take this. You can, and you will. I'll pay you back... soon. 
Just ask for help next time. Oh, you are so much like Ben. You have to learn to swallow that Parker pride and accept that you're human, like the rest of us. Martin. I'm sorry to interrupt. I just wanted to let you know I'm headed out of town. You're in charge while I'm gone. Well, you can count on me. How long will you be away? I really don't know. Is everything okay? It's some personal business I've been planning for a while. But please take care of this place. It represents the best part of me. Well, I guess I better get busy. <sighs> Hope Mr. Lee's okay. Are you sure you can spare that money? Easily. Working here leaves very little time to spend money, and I'm just fine with that. Hello? Hey, did you see my story? I did. Robbie must be pretty happy right now. Yeah, it kind of went viral. And get this, Mayor Osborne just announced he's going to give Officer Davis an award this afternoon. Wow. Wait, isn't Osborne's campaign rally this after- Oh, I see what he's doing. Yeah, we all do. But still a pretty cool moment for Officer Davis and his family. I'll be there covering it. Wanna join me? Yeah, of course. See you then. Humiliating taking money from May. I should head out into the city and try to pay it forward. Another message from Doc. Peter, I don't want to jinx us, but the lead I'm following might not only get the project back on its feet, but also expand it in ways we never could have imagined. Everything happens for a reason, even Norman pulling our plug. I really hope this works out. Doc's work is too important to go unfinished. Come on, Pidgey, just a little. Howard, long time no see. How's Pidgey doing? He's a little down today. Misses his cousins. Been a bit of a whirlwind for both of us. Owners of my building, rezoned for commercial. We had to move into Feast to get our bearings. I'm so sorry. New York landlords can really be heartless. When they kicked me out of my place, they set all my birds loose. Pidgey's the only one who found me. I've been looking everywhere for the rest of them, but with my bad leg and all... You know what? I get around. How about I keep an eye out for him? You do that? Oh, thank you. If you have any luck, please give me a call. Jeff, congrats on the ceremony today. I'll be glad when it's over. A truck full of armed demons scares me less than public speaking. But I'm calling about something else. What's up? Just got a tip that the demons are moving on the fifth construction site in Midtown. My wife would kill me if I ditched the ceremony prep to play cops and robbers, but I thought maybe my friendly neighborhood partner would want to know. Understood. I'll do a swing by, let you know what I find. And hey, here's a tip on public speaking. Just picture everyone in their underwear. Wait, not Osborne. You know what? Uh, never mind. <laughs> okay. Another camera. Gotta be Black Cat. Are you jealous I'm visiting my other man? I hope so. But you should know bad boys aren't my type. Aha. Why are you doing this, Felicia? No one gonna catch you.
masterpiece. Consolidated shipping. Jeff, I'm here. What do you see? Find the rest. The boss wants them dead. Looks like the demons are moving in on Fisk's territory. You got this? I got this. What you came for. You don't need to kill us, too. <laughs> Fisk's territory is ours now. Not today. Jumpsuit. Slimming. Stay out of my business. Wait, the demons. Who's their leader? Keep my men alive and maybe I'll tell you. Saving bad guys from other bad guys. Not how I thought today would go. Attention!
here. Wait for the police. Gotta find the survivors fast. Sleep it off. Big guy. Men are safe. Your turn. Who runs the demons? Maybe he's there. Maybe he isn't. Check the roof. I've missed these cryptic fist talks. just happen? Yeah. I'm getting reports of a helicopter with a wrecking ball? Yeah, things with the demons got complicated. Sit tight, Yuri. I got this. Call you when it's done. Now's 
my chance. Masks are so awesome. Where do you get them? Oh, I saw this. Yeah. Cool, thanks. Do they have a website? Uh, yes. Whoops. Hey, Yuri. I caught the bad guys, but... But what? You might want to bring a ladder. Yo, Miles. Hey, fanboy. I'm late. You coming? Uh, nah, I gotta get to City Hall for my dad's ceremony. All right. Tell your pops I said congrats. MJ, did they start the ceremony yet? They're still setting up. Where are you? Got hung up at work. Be there soon. Before you go, can you, can you sign this for my kid? And now for listener emails. May from Queens writes, You're so full of anger and I wish you'd get help managing it. It's terrible for your health. Now I know she speaks from a place of concern, but this is the common misconception that I have to correct. I'm not full of anger. I'm full of love. I call out injustice, corruption, and crimes against humanity because I adore this city, and I want it to be better. What you hear in my voice, it's love. Nothing but love!
There's the stage entrance. And we'll be right out front. <sighs> Sounds like a lot of people out there. You'll be fine, honey. Last time I gave a speech, I was in high school. Miss Steinberg gave me a C minus. <laughs> well, if only Miss Steinberg could see you now. Hey, you got this, Dad. I mean, come on, you saved Spider Man. I'm pretty sure that makes you an official superhero. <laughs> a superhero? <laughs> or maybe I'm just a guy who doesn't give up. <laughs> Come on, honey. Welcome, everyone. And before I hand it off to Mayor Osborne, I'd just like to say a few words. Our city is so, so? Such exemplary citizens I think this gang war may finally be over. That, like, I would like, to hand like it over, to over? Um, I mean, there's some loose ends still to be tied up, but... Loose ends. Well, a truck pulled away from the scene from a company called Consolidated Shipping. Something's not right about it. I just don't know what. Hmm. Well, maybe after this we can grab some coffee. Figure it out together. Yeah. Um... Well, thanks, Jim. Couldn't have said it better myself, but I'll try. We all know that Officer Davis is a hero. But, uh... Instead of coffee, maybe we could have dinner instead. I, I could come over, uh, I'll cook. Or we could, you know, meet at a totally neutral location for a completely normal meal cooked by professionals. <laughs> for acts of extraordinary bravery, above and beyond the call of duty, it is my privilege to present Officer Jefferson Davis with a department Medal of Honor. Phone call, sir. Kind of in the middle of something here, Jim. Sounds urgent, sir. Fine. Congratulations, sir. Uh, thank you, Mr. Mayor. I share this honor with my family. My wife, Rio, and my son, Miles. Without their support, I... I couldn't do what I do. Yes? I've worked many years for this moment. Who is this? Over the coming days, your company, your city, and everything you care about will be destroyed. People will beg you for help, but you won't be able to save them. <laughs> Listen, jackass. I get threats like this twice a week. Why don't you grow a pair and tell me what you want? To watch you suffer. Thank God! 
Can you hear me, baby? Can you hear me? I'm here. Voice my hand if you can hear me. Stay here. I'm going to find your father. Peter. Peter, wake up. Come on, say something, please. Right there. Right there. Gotta help him. Whoa! That was right there. Gotta help him. Oh, God. 
No! Enough! We have to leave. Now! I'm sorry for your loss. Do I know you? I'm Peter Parker. I was at City Hall when... Look, I know you don't know me, but I just wanted to say... I know what you're going through. Uh, that's what you were gonna say, right? Or it all gets easier with time. Don't worry, it's, it's part of God's plan. I'm sorry, I was just try trying to help. I know. I'm sorry about that. I don't know what I'm gonna do with him. started looking for Martin Lee yet? No, I told you I can't start a manhunt based on a hunch from Spider-Man. But I'm telling you, he's the guy. Get me some solid evidence and we'll talk. Solid evidence, right. Hey, it's me. Hey, so what are you thinking? I'm thinking I screwed up and that kid lost his father. I know you too well to say you should give yourself a break. What about the police? Do they have any leads on Lee? They're not even looking for him. Even Yuri doesn't believe me. Then it's up to us to find him. I've been doing some research. Go to this address. Martin Lee bought a controlling interest in this recycling center last year. You think he's hiding out there? Maybe. We know he's not at Feast. If he's not at the recycling center, maybe you'll find some evidence as to where he might be. Yeah. Good work, MJ. I'll let you know what I find. Oh, one more thing. I talked with a detective about questioning the arrested demons. They're all claiming Martin Lee has the power to, quote, corrupt people. Corrupt? What does that mean? They say it's sort of like mind control. It brings out the negative part of you. It makes you do things you wouldn't normally do. Uh, 
sounds a little far-fetched. This is coming from a guy who can run up walls. 